The point of this is not to tell the whole story of Queen Maud. This installation had to be magical, poetical, and give a glimpse into Maud. It should be kind of tempting. We kind of let people look at it, say, wow, we want more. When I got this commission from the government, uh, they wanted us to make an exhibition from the uh, photo albums of Queen Maud because they were not that known for the public and it tells a story from the royal um, family and uh, the monarchy in Norway. We created a, a site-specific uh, soundscape for, uh, for this installation that uh, brings in uh, 12 speakers to create a 3D sound environment. And the visuals and the, and the audio goes really hand in hand and gives you one unified experience using the, the specifics of the, of the tower. We 3D scanned six of Queen Maud's dresses with a process called photogrammetry and it allowed us to show delicate and precious museum objects up close and in motion. The six dresses give structure to and organize an animated film of historical photographs, both of and by Queen Maud, into thematic chapters. Usually we presented things behind glass, we presented them, people are not allowed to touch, they were it, it, kind of that distant thing. With this and the new media, you, you get closer to things, you can almost, as a visitor, talk to things, you can react. When I think of the development further with the new uh, exhibitions they will make at the National Museum, it will be completely different, a new world. <laughs> 